From National 9 News, this is Nightline with Jim Whaley. Refugee dilemma as Indonesia also shuts the door on banned freighter. Liberal Party admits a widening of the GST credit scheme and controversial Bradman letters returned to the Dons family. Good evening. Australia is locked in a diplomatic battle tonight over the future of more than 400 boat people picked up by a Norwegian freighter and now anchored off Christmas Island. The asylum seekers were rescued from their sinking ferry, but the government is refusing the freighter entry, saying it's a matter for Indonesia and Norway to resolve. But the Indonesians are also refusing to allow the ship into its waters, while the Norwegians say Australia has a moral responsibility to accept the boat people. Laurie Wilson has our report. After the break, the air crash death of a rock singer on the way up, and another day of death in the Middle East conflict. In a moment, the two surprise sports at the Goodwill Games and the cream of the world's athletes flood into Brisbane. Line the finance and weather, and in sport, rugby league, AFL and test cricket and an Australian surfing victory in France. The national weather and a low continues to affect the southeast while another cold front is moving towards Tasmania. A high dominates most of central and western Australia. The forecasts fine in Darwin and Brisbane, showers likely in Sydney, Canberra, Melbourne, Hobart and Adelaide, but it should be a fine day tomorrow for Perth. And that's the news this Monday night from all of us here at Nightline. Good night.